Hello everyone and welcome back to The Last of Us. Okay, so in the last part we kind of just seen the introduction to the game and this part we're going to um, go and find the traitor that's been stealing our ration cards. I've been selected for outside work duty. Oh, that's such crap. The soldiers are supposed to handle the outside. Right, you don't get much time to talk in this as well, like myself. I don't get to talk much because there's a lot of dialogue in this game. So I've got to try and find those open windows where I want to Attention. tell you guys stuff. Look at that. Ration line hasn't opened yet. It must be running low again. So we're living in a closed off zone right here. Where there's rations given out. It's kind of like a war zone. Protected by the government. Well, you call it protection, but look at this. People getting beaten because they might be infected. Right, let's, let's carry on with Tess. Seems like more people are getting infected. That just means more people are sleeping. Where's Mark at? They caught him trying to use fake rations. I gotta sell new papers. They shouldn't give us any static up there. Just play cool. Drive on through. Are we, are we walking forward, Tess? Why are you standing there? Let's go. There's a lot of subtitles and no vo no noise. It's getting mixed up with stuff in the background. What's your business here? Had the day off. Visiting a friend. What is sprint? Oh, one. Well, there we go. <laughs> just gonna spend the whole game just walking around. Okay, need to remember what the controls are. Equip the health code up on the D-pad and hold R2. Here we go. They're gonna close all the checkpoints. We're gonna have to go around the outside. Outside the wall. Or we could just let Robert go. <laughs> Cute. Hey Tess, you see that shit? I was there. Hey, how's the East Tunnel looking? Yeah, it's clear. I just used it. No patrols. And where are you off to? Gonna pay Robert a visit. You too? Who else is looking for him? Uh, Marlene. She's been asking around, trying to find him. Marlene? What do the Fireflies need with Robert? <laughs> you think she'd tell me? Well, what did you tell her? The truth. I got no idea where he's hiding. Good man. Hey, you stay out of trouble, all right? Military's gonna be out in force soon. Yeah, see you around. It's strange having no HUD, no indication of how much health I've got. You know, it's just no idea. Marlene looking for Robert? What do you make of that? I don't like it. We better find him before the fireflies do. This is us. Hey guys, how's it going? <sighs> Shit's stirring up out there. How are we looking over here? Uh, it's been quiet. No signs of military or infected. That's what I like to hear. Joel, give me a hand with this. Well, we got a little hidden passage behind us, behind this same um, cabinet. Yeah, I'll take it easy out there. I need to watch what they throw away down here. Be light. I'm expecting the, the lighting in this game to be looking really nice as well with the upgraded um, you know, graphics for the PS4. Our backpacks are still here from last time. I'm 
Not a lot of ammo. Mm, the shots count. Collector, one hundred dollars. Okay. Press R two while not aiming to reload. So I'll reload it. All right, Texas. I think I can tell. Yeah, if I look at the um, inventory, which is that. Oh no, so I think yeah, the touchpad is now with the new crafting system instead of pressing the one of the D-pad buttons. Um, you can see how much ammo you've got. So you can still know how much you've got, but not without checking. It's not displayed on the screen all, all times. You ready? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Come on. Go on. Plenty of hidden passageways up here, isn't there? Sneaking on out. Be careful. When am I not? <laughs> Is that a trick question. Ain't been out here in a while. It's like we're on a date. Well, I am the romantic type. You got your ways. There are opportunities to um, speak to characters in the in the environment. Like you just seen then, it was a triangle over a head. I just pressed it to make sure I got it and didn't miss the opportunity. Where's the ladder? Well, it's got to be around here somewhere. It just adds more to the story, you know, more um, character development. The ladder's behind this car, if I recall. That's right. Got it. Great. Bring it over. Here we go. So we're going to look to get up that hole over there. So we now press triangle to put the ladder in place. Ladies first. Of course, ladies first. Lady, you must be thinking of someone else. <laughs> it's all relative. This way. Down through here. One second before we carry on. Uh, there are like this game is all about scavenging. See, there we go already. That's just the collectible right there. But there is a lot of um, materials you need to collect to um, craft certain things like med med kits and also ammo to pick up. You know, in, in drawers and stuff. Here we go. So you got these um, the upgrade parts. You use them to um, upgrade your weapons. Once you get more weapons uh, and you go to a crafting bench, and you're able to. Oh shit, upgrade your equipment. So any chance I get from what I will try and remember where there are places to that are worth scavenging. Be better. Look, once we get our merchandise back, it should be easy to unload. Well, speaking of merchandise, when's that next shipment due? Oh, we're meeting Bill next month. More pills, lots of ammo. Supposedly. Hold up. Spores. So there are spores which can also get you infected as well as being bitten. We've got gas masks to protect us here from inhaling it. Where the hell are all these coming from? The place was clear last time. They're coming out of something. There's our culprit. Hey, Body's not that old. Better keep your eyes and ears open. So because that corpse has been there for so long, he's just like being letting out this gas that's just been, you know, making the air, this this same area just infected. You okay? Yeah. Damn ceiling's falling apart. Be careful. This way. Easy. She's not. Watch it, watch it. Help me. My mask broke. Don't, don't leave me to turn. Please. What do you want to do? Okay, so we got this guy here. He's not going to survive, and also, you know, his mask's broken, so he's going to die soon anyway. But if he dies, he will be turned to an infected, and that's not, it's not a good way to live, even if you're not conscious and aware of it. So we're going to end this guy's misery right here. The shot to the head. Poor bastard. Okay, there's some ammo to the floor there, which is um good because we just shot shot a bullet and we got a bullet back. Right, how do you reload? I'd say, yeah, you press the shoot button, don't you, without aiming. Okay, so we're going to carry on now with Tess. Carry on getting out beyond the um, the checkpoint. 
because we need to go find this guy that's been ste stealing our rations and messing up our deals. Okay, I'm not too sure which way to go. It's been a while since I played this. It's definitely not this way. So there's probably a past the door here. Yeah, there we go. We've got to crouch under this. I'm not sure if the infected can tell by a torch, so I'm going to turn it off. So you can t you can choke out infected and also people. I think it's square you spam? Yeah, I'm spamming square. I think that's doing the job. So you initiate it with the triangle, then you spam square to um, finish off the choke. So that guy's out. I'm going to keep my flashlight switched off. And there's two infected to the right there. We can sneak past them. Well, you could when I pre played it on PS3. If they've tweaked it in grounded mode where they're able to detect you, that could be a problem. So we're going to try and sneak past them. And we're going to go upstairs. Because I think... I'm not sure if that's the way to... Yeah, I think this is the way to go. Also in this game as well, um, you see Tess just ran through there. Your People that you're playing with, you're, you're escorting or, you know... Your partners that are maneuvering through the story with you, they won't be detected by any enemies if you're in stealth. So you never need to worry about their whereabouts or if they're going to be spotted. So we're going to still creep around, keep keep quiet because the infector can still hear us downstairs. I'm going to go in here, see if there's any loot to pick up. Because as well, because we're playing on ground, there is very lim limited amount of um, stuff to pick up. So we've got a note here we can read. I'm not going to read all the notes in this playthrough, guys. I'll just let you read them if you want to. You can pause it. Just because it takes so long, and I don't want to... Infected trying to sneak into the zone. As much as everyone complains about it, you had all these poor bastards wishing they were living on the inside. Also, there was a chocolate bar on that table, but um, you can only pick up them if you've already lost... You're not on full health, and you eat it on the spot. And because my health is full, I couldn't pick it up. So we're gonna drop down here. All right, that's all of them. Let's hope so. So I've only got four bullets, haven't I? <laughs> Some fresh air. I remember when I played this on Survivor difficulty on PS3. Why don't you ask Bill to get you some of them air fresheners? There's very limited ammo. Do we need to? Here. here we go. She's got this. Cover the entrance. I got it. Before we carry on, um, and if on these shelves, you gotta check every corner. You know when you was very limited supplies. So we climb up here. Damn it! Plank fell down. So we need to get across this gap here. We're gonna do that by dropping down here, and there's, and there's a plank we can pick up here. And we're gonna pass it to um, Tess, and then we'll make our way back up there. Here, pass it to me. It's a bit heavy. I think I can handle it. All right, she's got that. All right. Okay, now we're gonna jump through this gap. And get make our way back up there and cross the plank with Tess. There's a lot of jokes on the internet, it memes and stuff about how this is the same developers, isn't it, as in um, Uncharted? And just this this gap here would easily be jumped by Drake, and we've got to go and get a plank because uh, <laughs> I don't know. Let's test drop down there. She is. Make sure there ain't any soldiers around. It's clear. Come on. So let's just carry on. One of the essential things in a zombie apocalypse as well, guys, is a, um, a backpack, a good backpack to carry all your supplies. It's the number one rule. Right, we go through the door. Yep. Shut it. 
as well playing on this difficulty you've kind of got to play it stealthily as much as you can because there is you, you can't always run, run and gun because there's just not enough ammo to use Sure the coast is clear? No soldiers, none of Robert's men, yeah? You know he's expecting us. Well, that'll make it more interesting. <laughs> Any kids in this game as well? Here you go, he's not on the window. I've all been born in this apocalypse because there's 20 years have passed, you know? Take this, take this! Really, how you doing today? I heard you Not got right now, Terrence. No, 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 it's, it's good. Look, Not I got the car. Now, you hear me? Okay. You can do that. God, Terrence. God, I'll be back. Am I leading the way? Oh. You touch it, you buy it. I'm not touching Terrence, anything. It's been a while. You don't visit us anymore. Who the hell is that? There's a lot of talking in this game as well, like just the environment. Anywhere time there's people, they're always talking. The realism. Where do you think you're going? Malik, sit back down. Oh, sorry, Tess. Didn't realize you two were together. Go ahead. Who's that? An old headache. Don't ask. I'm looking for Robert. He come through here? Half hour ago. He went back to the wharf. He's there now. Us through. You guys need to turn around and head back if you know what's good for you. Our beef isn't with you. We just want Robert. You don't want to do this. Turn the fuck around and leave now. I'm not going anywhere without Robert. Bitch, I will bash your skull unless you turn around and get your dumb ass out of here. Fuck this. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Take cover. You ready? Yeah. I'll, I'll cover you. Get the angle on them. Okay, so I've got to flank them. I've only got four bullets, so we've got to be very picky with the shots. There's two guys, both behind that container right there. I love this as well, guys. If you are up against the cover and there's a companion with you, the way you go around them, it's just so fluent. Look at that. You're like you're protecting her. There's even different angles of it. It's like different positions. Like It's not just it locks in. You can go closer, closer. So we will got to go around to the right here. Hopefully they won't spot us. Maybe take one out. There you go. One headshot. She's shooting this guy. He's down. Okay, I think we've got two shots. One shot left. Okay. Nicely done, Texas. We gotta inspect these guys' bodies for any bullets. Here we go. How the hell did he get all these guys? If Robert's good at one thing, it's writing blank checks. Let's go put an end to that. The aiming in this should, should should be a lot easier for me as well because just the PS4 pads aiming is just so nice compared to the PS3. Right, so we're jumping over this wall. Gives a boost. Come on. So it looks like this might be more heavily guarded. More of Robert's guys. How do you know they're coming? Two of our guys died trying to take Tess out. I guarantee that she and Joel are on their way here right now to get Robert. Jesus. We shouldn't have taken this job. Not our call. 
Let's spread out and make sure no one's creeping around in here. Yeah, word, word travels fast around here, doesn't it? They know we kill people already. So she's taking that guy out over there with, with a knife. Ooh, crazy bitch. I'm gonna take this guy out. I don't have a knife though, I just gotta choke him. You can also use people as a home human shield. But I prefer to just take him out and then move on to the next target. So like this guy's down. We're heading inside this building. Okay, there's two guys here. I meant to tell you, I was down on Jordan Street, and all these soldiers showed up with a group of about five sibs, all in handcuffs. Let me guess. Fireflies. Yep. They lined them up against the wall and bang, bang, bang. They just executed all of them. We let these guys get in position, and I should be able to take out this guy at the back in the hat. And Tess should take out the other guy. So if I grab him, start choking him, Tess comes through the door. Yep, she's got a shiv on him. Teamwork. This guy's got a key on him. So we can stand up now, make some noise, because there's no more enemies in the area. Yeah, that's, we definitely got to always search. It's your, always your priority. Any chance you get, there's a health bar there, but we've also got... Oh, We've still got full health, so that's not required. So just, I think, on easy difficulties, there'll be a lot of stuff in there. You know, because it's like a storage place, and it's just nothing on this difficulty. It's grounded difficulty. Not even on the desks here, so we're going to go ahead. Nothing to be found. We can't craft anything yet anyway, so that's probably why there's no supplies. We can pick up bottles here as well. What about Robert? Who's he holding up with tonight? Guy's too paranoid to stay here by himself. Fuck if I know. We'll check in with the others and come up with something. Okay. So we've got one bullet and we've also got a bottle. That's our only equipment for the moment. We can also fist fight. So what we're gonna do here, we'll probably take this guy out right here. Take a grab on him. Choke him out. There's a guy over there on the other side. He hasn't spotted us yet. Maybe... Okay. So he's going to go in there. We're going to creep upstairs. And then there's a guy that went up these stairs just then. So he should be up here somewhere. There he is. It's better that way. We'll go around the outside. Hopefully no one will spot us. There are people. Upstairs though with us. So we're gonna creep back with him a little bit. Now that we're out of sight of that room, we'll choke this guy out. I wouldn't say it's like a, a down point over this though, but I was gonna say, um, I wish it was more animations to stealth kills, because it's always the same choke. You know, he, he never like bashes him in the head a few times and then chokes him or knees him and then, you know, whatever. It's always the same choke. Which is it's fine. Uh, it doesn't bother me that much. I just thought they would have added a few more animations. Okay, so we've got a guy up top there. We've got this guy at the bottom. Take him now while no one's looking. I'm going to sneak behind this container. This cover. Well, let's choke him behind this box. And now we've got two guys up there. We've got one bullet to use. So we're going to try and do it as stealthily as possible. Impressive. We're going to go back upstairs on their level. So we're not, like... They haven't got the height of the, um, the advantage of being above. So we'll take these stairs up here. Equip the bottle. Oh, we got four bullets now, actually. When did we get them bullets? Oh shit, we got the bullets off the guys when we shot them, I think. So we haven't got one bullet. Also, on this difficulty as well, guys, you can't use the, um, the listen mode. You know, where you can look through walls and see enemies. You've just pretty much got to use your eyes. So there's one guy there. Where was the other guy? I'm sure the other guy's to the right as well. Like, just on the other side of that door. Let's check the left hand side first. Okay, we're gonna step here. Here we go, here he is. So we'll, um. We'll watch these guys patrol for a second. Let that guy stop there. We'll take him out now. Hopefully, this, this guy on the, uh, the outside won't spot us. I don't think he comes all the way, and I don't think he looks into the room, so it'll be okay. There he is. So when he turns his back, like now, we'll take him out. Oh. 
There we go. Because that guy was the last guy in, in the area. When you stealth kill him, you just do a brutal kill. We should have brought more people. Yeah, they just slow us down. Yeah, you're right. So we've got a shiv here we can use. Okay, shivs are used, for, um, like I was saying before about more animations. There is another animation which is a shiv. But once you use the shift too many times, you can't use it anymore. So it's a limited use thing. The reason why you would use a shift is because it's a quicker quicker kill than it is choking. So it gets them out of the way quicker. But it's also a limited use. Right, there's a help back here on this, this table. Alright guys, before we carry on, um, we're going to go... Actually, we're going to go through these doors in the next part. So we're going to end it here. And we'll go find Robert in the next part, guys. So um, I'll see you later, guys.